Okay, so we're going to be looking at goal one formulas, um, specifically from the final exam revision A. And we're just going to be going straight through in order, starting with goal one, number one. Now, up at the top, you see that we have all of the formulas, and these are the exact same formulas you'll be getting for the final exam. Looking at the first question, Zainab owns a health food store. In March, sales were 122,000 dirhams. In April, sales were 108,770 dirhams. What was the rate of decrease? Now, when we're looking at rate, we need to take the bigger number minus the smaller number, divide by b, which is our original number, and then multiply by 100. So let's go ahead and look at this. The bigger number is 122,000. So I'm going to take 122,000 and subtract the smaller number, 108,770. Now, we divide this by the original number. So the original number, here we have March sales and April sales. The number that comes first is considered the original. So we're going to divide this by 122,000. And then the very last step, according to our formula, is to multiply it by 100. We do this with all rate problems because the answer we'll get is a decimal or a fraction. And to convert, we have to multiply by 100. Now your calculator should have a math here and should have a little d in a box here. If it doesn't, go ahead and clear it out. Um, to clear, you just do Shift 9 and follow the instructions. But we'll go ahead and start with this problem. We're going to do 122,000 minus 108,770. And we'll put that divided by 122,000. And then at the end, multiply by 100. And we get a fraction here. So we're going to go ahead and hit SD, and we should get 10.84%. So if we look at the choices, we see 11.5, 10.8, 12.2, and 13.5. In our case, 10.84 was what we found, so this is going to be the correct choice.